Well, here we are, guys. Una. I can't say that in here. Well, anyways, right, Unadilla, 250C row. Let's do some racing. All I can say about that is, I survived. There's 34 people in my row today. Coming through about mid-pack. Jeez, I didn't even know my row was going off. Like, normally they split it left and right. And I forget, I think right goes first, then left. So it's like, oh, I'll start my bike one last time. Well, no, my row went that time. What is this, an orgy? Nah, just kidding. Made it right through that, I don't know what the hold up was. How much do you want to bet that guy's bike blew up by the end of this race? My goal for this race, just ride smooth, try and stay upright, we all know I'm not very good at that, and uh, just pick good lines and just finish the race of course. The one key thing you'll notice in this video is Unadilla, you're never alone. There's always a bike by you, someone in front of you, behind you, next to you. There's always someone. But well, there's gotta be at least... Here, yeah, let's check. Just check, there was 718 riders in this 10 a.m. race. Ah! 
So, I was talking to Adam Gordon here before the race. He works for Racer TV. And he gets to ride the tracks a couple days before. But he was telling me about this hill climb. Yeah, he uh, said the left side's probably the easiest. Right side, eh, medium. Middle, most difficult. What I choose? Middle. Of course, that dim one had a fall in front of me. No, I'm just kidding. You're not a dim one, dude. Well, maybe you are. But, uh, the, he fell and I lost all my momentum, and now we're pushing. Well, everybody's looking at me. It's like, come on, just pull me up. Like, come on. Then we're on this cobblestone, and, oh, that stuff, you just spin. No matter what. And then, listen to my bike here. It stays, like, revved up. From that point on, I told myself, not taking that line again. Hey, there's 1872, Christian, I believe. He just snuck by me through that mud section. I'm telling you, don't even have to be fast here. You just have to pick the right lines to avoid all the bottlenecks. Like this. Why did I go there? Yeah, tell me about it. See, I was like, ooh, a hotline. But I'm like, oh shoot, the trail goes that way. I don't want to go off course and get disqualified or something. Uh, my stupid fender gets stuck around this tree. Uh, it's going to be a long race. Thank you. Yep. Lap one, right in the box. Just like good old saying, say that every video come through. 23rd. Huh. Not too good. Wait, too good, too well? Ah, no. Look at this. Just, hey, look. There's Jake from 3D Machines right in front of me. Should have just took the left line. Oh, well.
There goes Jake. What in the world? That guy just tried to hop over that guy's bike. I bet that guy's seat got torn right up. From that. Look at this, coming upon that big hill climb, and I'll take the bypass. Let me tell you. Yeah, just told you. Yep, exactly. Yep, good point. What the? Look at this. Even the bypass is a bottleneck. One guy goes down. Or hits and you almost go down. Because just a whole nother pile up. Oh, just push the guy over. Don't, why don't you? This part was real funny though. I'm sitting here waiting. Look over. There's Ronnie. It's like a lap. Or a half a lap in front of me. It's like what the? I guess I'm way behind. That's my new pass call. Moment of truth, baby! We're gonna jump the sky shot. Mm, just kidding. That guy at the beginning of the video, he was in the morning fun. He was a sea rider. Well, he was probably a B rider riding sea. But he cleared the thing. I, did he go around the hay bales? Did he go between them and just dump the clutch? Like, I wanna know. I wanna jump that stuff. Just kidding. That would be it. Terrible idea. <laughs> Heard it right there. Lap two done. We're in 19th. Made up a few spots. Ooh. That guy just hit. Face full of cereal right there. That, that's cereal. Dirt. Oh my god. Look who it is. It's Adam Thomas right there. Hey, buddy! God, that would have been terrible if I landed right on that guy. Holy, just thinking about that, just right on his rear fender. Hey, there goes Adam again. We end up getting a battle right to the finish line, pretty much. So, 
I'm probably gonna shut up. Uh, I mean, who wants to listen to me? But uh, let's just watch. Sit back and watch us battle it out. Lap three done, going on to our last. We're in 16. Still trying to catch up with Adam here. Would you look at that? Yeah, I know, I crashed, but hey, I think it was only my second one of the day. Right, because I had that one spill over on that turn between the gate. Yeah, felt bad going here, but Adam and I are going, he's like right on my butt. That guy was strapped under his bike. I should have just pulled over and helped him, but yeah. Nobody had helped me. I'm just kidding. Oh, there goes Adam again.
So Adam's right there, right in front of me. I was supposed to pit there. But I'm like, nope, this is last lap. Adam's right there, and now we're getting close to the finish. I was like, there's no time to stop for gas. Worst that happens is I run out and I get towed back. But let's hope that doesn't happen. Jeez, look at this rhythm. It's like a white boy trying to rap. <clears throat> Don't remind me. I know. I tried it once. Once is enough. So Adam's still right in front of me. He's in visual range. Time to shoot up. No, no, no. This is racing. We're hunting at it. Jeez. But I know we have maybe a mile left. Mile and a half tops. All right. All right. There he is. I was like, we gotta do this. Gotta make the move on him here. Not that type of move. We're gonna make the passing move. Gotta plan this out. Thinking we just. I don't know what I'm thinking. Probably just a sneak attack plan will do, I guess. Oh, we got hung up a little. Is that. No. Couldn't capitalize on that mistake. Alright, it's now or never. Oh, we did it! We, we flippin' did Never mind. He almost ran us over. My bad on that part. Um, just knew we were coming close to the finish. I was like, gotta make a move. Gotta pass him. Gotta beat Adam. Well, it turns out... There's... Still quite a bit of time. I mean, I don't know. I mean, it's racing. You never know what's gonna happen. But hey, it's alright. Had fun battling with you, Adam, for the entire race, pretty much. For the last two laps, really helps me become a faster rider, and I, I like it. It makes you like forget like how tired you are, and like. Yeah, from that crash, my arm kind of right in the funny bone. It wasn't funny. But yeah, battling like that, it's just, it's fun. Like, you totally forget about everything around you, and you're just like, all right, let's see how I can pass him here, and blah, 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 blah. 
Oh, it's a ton of fun. Just wish I could have made the pass on him and kept it upright. I had plenty more time to make a pass further on. But hey, what are you gonna do? Anyways, that sums up Unadilla 2017. What'd you expect? It's me riding. Nah, I'm just kidding. But, uh, that's the race, and, um, finished 16th in my class of 34 and 250C, uh, junior, 14th, 17th. 328 out of the 600 or no the 700 whatever so had fun battling with Adam I, I, I don't know speechless I guess anyways here's some clips of the PM race of some of those guys and uh, thanks for tuning in Here at our Punch Unlimited Unadilla GNCC.